Hey everybody, it's Emily, the Crazy Worm Lady. Do you see what I see? I open this bin and I'm not immediately seeing springtails crawling all over my edges. I'm sure they're in here, but I'm wondering if what we did helped a little bit. So if you remember, we did some uh, watermelon, I believe over here, like blended up with some other food. And the worms seem to be getting into it my air conditioning is broken right now and of course it's been the hottest week all year I think kind of unusually hot in the upper 90s so in my house right now it's about 80 degrees although these bins don't feel too warm to me I think they're fine the bin itself feels a little bit dry but the fact that I mean there's a marked reduction in the amount of springtails. So we must be doing something right. So I'm gonna lay this back out here. I'm gonna moisten it down and we will get another feeding up in here. So let me go grab that and we will add it to the bin. So here's some food I thawed. Uh, I drained off some of the excess liquid. And I'm not going to feed all of it to the worms, but I am going to give them a healthy feeding. If I can get it out of here. Probably a little bit more than I should add. Let me pull one of these banana peels. Alright, so... Let's see what we can do with this. I'm gonna spread it all along this side over here since we fed over here last week. And like I said, this is a, a healthy, healthy feeding. I'm gonna be away uh, for about a week. However, you never want to overfeed or feed more than your worms can handle. Um, the bin can get acidic, too hot. Um, and potentially get sour, which can injure or kill your worms with uh, what they call protein poisoning or string of pearls. So, actually, let me grab a little eggshell as well. Look at this setup, guys. It's a mess over here. So, got a nice big handful of, actually, this is oyster shell, not eggshell, but works the same way. It's a buffer, acts as grit for the worms. And let's load this up with cardboard. I have a few um, plants that I put in my garden a little bit late. We've had some really bad weather lately and I couldn't get out to put my garden in. We had almost a month straight of rain. But I put the garden in about a week and a half ago with plants I started from seed. And I will put those up in the corner here as I'm loading this up so you can take a look at that. I have a bell pepper plant that's doing really well and a squash. So I'm, I'm pleased with how that's going. So I just want to make sure that this is buried pretty well. I have seen a few fruit flies in here lately, so ensuring that your food is covered up will help a lot. So I think that it's pretty good. We do have a little citrus in here, but as we know, um, citrus in, in small amounts has been fine in my bins. So I'm going to leave it like this, and when I get back from my trip, we will give an update. So drop your comments below, like this video, subscribe if you'd like some more content from me, and I'll be back with you guys soon for an update.